y'all. Thank you for coming to hang out with me. As many of you know, I'm a huge foodie. I'm always trying to find things that taste good and make me feel good and of course keep me looking good and healthy. And so yesterday I was at the Fresh Market in Greenville, North Carolina and I found these babies right here. Green beans, cauliflower, and artichoke. Now, I spent my whole childhood hating vegetables and I didn't discover that vegetables could be tasty when prepared correctly <laughs> until I was like 35. So for me, finding these is kind of, you know, um, I don't know how to put it. It's kind of like scary <laughs> because even though I know veggies can be good when prepared properly, I have some trauma from having them not prepared. Let's just say not in the way that I would prefer. Okay, I won't say that, but anyway, so I have no idea what these taste like. I've never had them before, but I thought, well, if these are really tasty, they would make the best snack. And I love the fact that they are shelf stable. They are in these little airtight pouches. So I don't have to worry about them spoiling anytime in the near future. They may just be perfect for my next trip. I can have snack alternatives that are healthy and still get my veggies in. So we're gonna start with cauliflower. <laughs> I know they say save the best for last. Cauliflower is my favorite of these three veggies. I feel like you can't mess up cauliflower. It's just good no matter what you do to it. Um, so I'm gonna try the cauliflower first. We'll see how it tastes. Ooh, it has a strong smell. Definitely has that cruciferous smell. If you eat broccoli or cauliflower, you know what I'm talking about. They're pungent. Mm, oh my God, oh my God. Mm -hmm. So this is very good. It is something that I could definitely have as a snack. Huh, which one next? Let's try artichoke. Artichoke is the vegetable that I'm least familiar with. I actually just started eating it like two years ago. <laughs> I never really had it before. I never grew up with it. It was never around. I mean, of course I saw it at like restaurants and events, but it just, you know, didn't really look very appealing. So I wasn't really about to like jump on it. And I think I just, you know, felt one day my son and I were doing a fondue and I had heard that artichokes were really tasty. And I was like, you know, hey, let's, let's get some artichokes. And he was like, yeah, let's get some. And so <laughs> I tasted it and I liked it. So let's see how it is as a snack. This is steamed and marinated artichokes with basil and thyme. The smell is nice. The smell is very pleasant. Not like the cauliflower. Um, okay. Tangy. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I like it, but I wouldn't say that I would jump for joy to eat it. It's kind of like, um, kind of has like a steaky taste to it. Kind of reminds me of eating some steak. Um, so yeah, I don't, I don't know. This would be my first choice, but it's not bad. It's not bad on my face to say it otherwise, because something about the tanginess of it is making it hard for me to keep a happy face. <laughs> it's not bad, it really isn't bad. It just isn't my favorite. So last but not least is French green beans. Green beans is a veggie that I have a love-hate relationship with. I think they are just perfect, lightly steamed, not a lot of thrills, but growing up I had them either boiled to death or out of a can, which to me is absolutely disgusting. It's mushy and brown and just gross. So I can't eat them if they're not made just right. Um, these are, of course, steamed and marinated with lime and garlic. So hopefully these are not mushy because the mush is what always gets me with vegetables and um tasty let's see okay they're not as green as i like they're more on the yellow side i already don't like that let's try oh they got crunch okay these are good i like these i like these these i can deal with as a good stack 
guys. Yash, yash, yash. So this is something I might would have also when I'm doing light meals, because a lot of times I travel and do light meals and I may just have like a bone broth and a cup and some nuts. I may have one of these too as like a side. So, so yeah, I can't complain. I think I paid about $3 and some change for each of these. So they're moderately priced. I wouldn't say they're inexpensive because that can add up. But if you're traveling and like, this is like, you know, gonna give you sustenance for a long time, you can't beat it. Um, of course, it's packed with vitamins and minerals because that's what veggies do. So these are great. I mean, these are really a great healthy alternative to snacking when you are traveling. You get your veggies, you get your vitamins and minerals, and you get low calories. <laughs> you can't beat low calories. 10 calories for the cauliflower, 20 for the beans, and 15 for the artichoke. They have a little bit of olive oil in them, but not enough to give you a whole gram of fat. So. Hey, I hope you like this tasting. Um, if I had to rank these, I would say probably cauliflower is still my best. <laughs> then the green beans, my second fave, and then the artichokes. Uh, I think I may have to get used to the artichokes. I still haven't had them, but a handful of times, so it's still an unfamiliar flavor to me. So I gotta practice my love affair uh, with artichokes a little bit more. So. Anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out with me again. I hope you enjoyed. Please make sure to follow me if you're not already. And please send me stars. That helps me continue to make great content for you guys. Send me stars. It's very important. And, of course, like and share. Deuces.